I get confused there because as the governor, you have had 10 years since the initiament, that ain't even a goddamn word, since the initiament of Prop 47 in the state to say, hey, you know what? Maybe we shouldn't allow motherfuckers to steal $950 worth of shit without any real consequence. Maybe we should do something about that. I don't know if this is working. As we can all say, it's clearly not working. There are... There are a plethora of not only just large-scale businesses, but small businesses, minority-owned small businesses that are being affected by the negative effects of Prop 47. And bringing all this up because, ironically, it's election year. It's election year. You know, a lot of things are coming into conversation right now. Newsom to speak, picked the ironic time to not only make actual legislative changes to the homeless problem that we have here, which I've talked about in other videos, but to actually make a change when it comes to this retail theft shit. Case in point, a few days ago, he signed a few laws into effect that are supposed to help with the prosecution of these individuals who participate in this retail theft. One of which, for example, is a change that with Prop 47, as we have in current effect right now, if you steal up to $950 worth of shit in one case, that is just a misdemeanor, right? The change he just added was, well, if you did that in this one instance, say, for example, you stole all this shit in Alameda, but if you did it in other various counties as well, too, we can combine all that together and prosecute that and say, OK, well, in this case, he stole that. In this case, he stole that. And 20, you know, as the three thousand dollars worth of shit, OK, now it's no longer a misdemeanor. Right. So that's progress. To me, it's not that much progress because most thefts ain't get most thieves are not getting in the Jeep from Jurassic Park and driving from Santa Clara to Sacramento County steal shit. Now they might they might drive from Alameda County to San Francisco to San Francisco County or goddamn uh, um, uh, Solano County to maybe uh, honestly Solano County to Richmond, but they ain't driving like that like that. But it is what it is. Um, I want to take this conversation and talk about Prop Thirty Six because that's where the real change comes into effect, and this is gonna be the part two of this part two.